Hey everybody, this is Dr. Flight. How are you? Um, this is a week six roundup. So we're moving into week six and the start of the week here. Um, just want to walk through where we are, what we're doing. So as we look at week six, um, we're talking about um, segmenting and targeting, but we're also talking about the consumer, the consumer, how the consumer makes decisions and um, the way um, companies start to view and look at the decision-making process. So analyzing ideal customer segments, segmenting and entry strategies. Certainly we spend a good amount of time thinking about the criteria that we use to do segmenting in general and um, creating customer profiles. And um, maybe to start it off or to think about customers, we look at their customer decision-making process and the, we introduce the idea of journey mapping um, as a functional tool. So there's four main kind of ideas uh, or components, I guess, in terms of content for this week. Um, they go along with chapter five in our strategy book. Um, so read chapter five, think about that. Um, there are some, there are some um, articles that will help along the way. So two of them in particular, um, children's toys grow up uh, to be a drinking game in Germany. And then also there's a millennial one, a short article about millennials, and that would be an age cohort. And age cohorts is, are one way we use, one method is used to, to segment markets. So those two articles in particular um, are good articles to discuss. Um, the the Looping Louie children's game um, article, uh, which has been turned into a drinking game, is the focus of your discussion question for this week. So um, read that article and kind of think about its role, uh, the role of segments, market segments, um, for products <clears throat> as you do that, that discussion question. So that discussion forum is open and available, um, uh, or it will be shortly. Um, the other the other thing that you do each week um, is the reflection. So as you go through the week, you reflect on on the material that's due next. You know, on the fifth, uh, both of those are on the fifth next week. So think about those, um, and and then um, and that's kind of kind of it. Now um, there is something called profiling. So the prism cluster narratives. That's just kind of a reference more than anything else in terms of what's there. And then there's a couple articles that focus on customer experience and journey maps. Um, those aren't particularly long articles. Those would be good just to read. Um, and I try to have a mix of reading that's practitioner focused and then probably some that's more theory based. So most of the readings this week are more practitioner focused. And so I think those, those will be fun for you. Um, looking ahead, we also have the introduction of part two for your projects. So um, part one was, was, was good. Um, I'll have another video that talks about projects here coming out to you here shortly. Um, but um, we want to, you, as your group, should get together and do uh, part two of the um, project process. And also looking ahead, we have our second case. Now, I know we just did uh, this last week, we did uh, P&G scope. Um, so the next case is coming along. It's not due you know, for a couple weeks away, but I wanted just to put it on your radar so that you know it's, it's coming up and it's posted available in Moodle for you. Um, okay, so again, as we kind of look through this, your weekly reflection and your, and your discussions, those are things that we're looking to do right away this, this week. Um, go ahead and think about this stage two, work with your groups to do that. And then we'll also have moving into the future case number two on the horizon. Um, so those are kind of the activities this week. It's an exciting week. I'm, I like look forward to this week because segmenting, targeting, and positioning are three aspects that are core marketing strategy things that we do. And this week in particular, we look at the idea of targeting and of segmenting. Next week when we do branding, uh, so week seven down the road, week seven when we do branding, we'll also introduce positioning um, during that discussion. So that'll be, again, next week. 
Uh, but be that as it may, this is this is week number six, and uh, this is your roundup for the week. Um, keep letting me know if you're having uh, any difficulties. Everything seems to be in a pattern now. Um, I think I think we're we're all making great progress. I'm excited to see what your discussions have to offer. Um, and, uh, and your f- reflections and all that you, you bring to the table. Thanks for the hard work. Uh, continue to let me know if you have any, any questions about the course, and I'd love to touch base with you. Thanks.